Don't be casual in learning. Don't be lazy in learning. Information is the key. Okay. Learning is the beginning of wealth. Learning is the beginning of health. Learning is the beginning of prosperity. Learning is the beginning of democracy, the beginning of freedom. All values, all virtues start with the learning process. So don't be lazy in learning. Don't be lazy in gathering the library that will teach you and instruct you. Money doesn't make you sophisticated. Only study and practice makes you sophisticated. Only study and practice makes you cultured. And only study and practice makes you happy. Study and practice makes you rich. Key phrase, don't be lazy in learning. One, how to do well. Next, how to live well. Don't be lazy in learning and practicing the art of economics, practicing the art of productivity, and practicing the art of lifestyle. Success is a numbers game. I'm asking you to be mature enough to start checking your own numbers. How many books have you read in the last 90 days? Transform your life. Become cultured, powerful, sophisticated, healthy, influential, all the rest of the stuff you want. How many books? How many classes? How committed are you to taking what's available and turning it into equities unprecedented since we live in a country that has been no such country in the last six and a half thousand years? Get smart. At the, that's what these journals are for. That's what pad and pencil's for. That's what taking notes is for. See if you can't increase your ability to comprehend ideas, information that can be life transforming. Don't miss the opportunity to learn. Take a good key phrase home, use it in your training. Don't be lazy in learning. Don't be casual in learning. Develop a whole new intensity for the 90s that you're not going to miss the information. You're not going to miss the stories. You're not going to miss the details. Get smart. Here's a couple of parts to it. Number one, your own personal experience. Right? If you've had a bad week, just sit down and ponder that for a while. Study it. See if you can't pick up some ideas from a poor week and then make a better week. Okay? Learn from your own experiences. One way to learn to do it right is do it wrong. I mean, you know, that's one way to learn to do it right. Do it wrong. Now, the key is don't let it take too long. If you've done it wrong for a year, we suggest that's long enough. You don't need another year just to prove a point. No, one year is enough. This is called the possibility for life change starts with education. Don't be lazy in learning. Don't be lazy in picking up the ideas. Don't be lazy in learning from your own experience. Learning is the beginning of wealth. Learning is the beginning of life change. Some people want to start with motivation. You don't start with motivation. Somebody says, just motivate this guy. He'll be all right. The answer is no, probably not. If a guy's an idiot, you motivate him. Now you've got a motivated idiot. No. So education, get smart. Don't miss the training class. You say, well, I've already been to one of those classes. I've already heard it. Got a good phrase for you to take home. That's no sign you got it. Just because you've listened to those millionaire tapes one time, it's no sign you've got it. I'm asking you to listen to them over and over and over. I'm asking you to dedicate yourself to a new level of learning. You know, study, learn, grow, change, develop. Never let it be said you didn't learn, right? If you want to solve your problems, you got to learn. If you want to take advantage of an opportunity, you got to learn. Develop your own personal philosophy here. Philosophy, major determining factor in how your life works out. Each person's philosophy is like the set of the sail. The same wind blows on us all. The difference in where we arrive at the end of the week, at the end of the month, at the end of the year, is not the wind that blows. But what's going to make the major difference? Each person's personal philosophy that sets a better sail, sets a better sail. So don't ask for a more favorable wind. That's like wishing something that's not going to occur. Don't ask for better seed and soil. All you got's what's available. Don't curse what you got. The key is to set a better sail and turn what you've got into the miracle of your, of your future. Don't wish it was easier. Wish you were better. Don't wish for less problems. Wish for more skills. That's the reason for coming here, spending a couple of days of intense effort, 
taking notes, rolling up your sleeves, going to work, commit yourself to learning so that you can get smarter for the days ahead. Life is worthwhile if you learn. You gotta know, you gotta have the information. When I talk to the kids in school, that's what I say. Get the information while you're here. What you're gonna do with it, that's up to you. Throw it all away, that's up to you. Just use a little of it, that's up to you. But while you're here, get it all.